And then, you know, working to achieve that ideal body weight and whatever you have left, we can sculpt our home with micro to meso liposuction. Sounds like an overall wellness approach is something that you're a big proponent of, and I think the best way to find out a little bit more is to take advantage of a complimentary consultation. Absolutely. If you'd like to receive that complimentary consultation with Dr. Thomas Katoski, you can reach him at 623-516-2639, and there's the office information on the screen for the Cosmetic Surgery Institute. You'll find it in the 19,000 block of North 27th Avenue, Suite 101, and you can also visit them online at bonniebykatoski.com. The Cosmetic Surgery Institute is a sponsor of Sonoran Living Live. The most common question I get about liposuction is, can it be used for weight loss? And the answer is, we really like patients to come in closer to their ideal body weight so it becomes more of a sculpting procedure. However, we have treated so many patients that have lower body obesity or different problem areas that have not responded to weight loss, and we stage those procedures where we're actually removing X amount of fat each time in a very safe manner to get the best result. We've all seen the pictures of the so-called cat lady and Barbie, and I think everyone would agree that both have had a little too much plastic surgery, but how much is too much? Dr. Thomas Katowski from the Cosmetic Surgery Institute is here to break it down for us. I'm sure when you see people like that, it just sort of makes you your skin crawl. <laughs> I mean, it's very sad. It's sad that there's a practitioner out there that took that individual in and did that to them. What do you think the problem was? You think that they obviously went to someone that wasn't experienced in it, but they just did it way too many times? I think it's both of those factors. I think you have individuals that go to people that aren't reputable. Right. And that will, you know, behave charlatanistic. They'll do a procedure on anybody. And regardless if that's appropriate or not, they do the work. And some of these people are never satisfied because they have what's called body dysmorphic mm. uh, disorder where they just, they see so things that... So what they're that, thinking is a little bit different than what the doctor's thinking, Absolutely. or a lot different. They see things that other people can't see, and they are constantly trying to rejuvenate something or change something that doesn't need to be changed. I think all of us sort of have a little bit of that <laughs> in us, don't you think? But, think? but you can go too far. Absolutely, and I think you need to find the right doctor that will basically help you and steer you in the appropriate direction. Now, do you ever turn patients away? Absolutely. I mean, every consult day will turn many patients away because the reality of it is not all patients can be helped and not all patients really have the issue that they're looking at. Right. And how do you know that a patient is actually psychologically ready for surgery? I think it, it entails a very good history and physical, a good discussion with that patient. Plus, there's a psychological profile that we do on all patients mm. that come through. They do a little question answer survey that we look at prior to surgery. And how do you know that, or I should say, how do you find the right doctor? I mean, there's so many doctors out there and we see doctors out there. Is it, is it just about the, the trust factor, the, the feeling that you get, or how do we know? You know, again, I, I've said it before, I think you need to go to the board, mm -hmm. you need to research the physician, you need to look at their credentials, you need to go to someone that's involved professionally, that is a professor, that, that teaches, uh, that has a high volume of procedures, that has a great reputation in the community. Yeah, I think that, that is definitely key. We've got a before and after picture, and uh, we're going to go ahead and take a look at someone that, that had some, some work done. It looks pretty nice. Well, this is what a natural cosmetic procedure should look like, right? A natural cosmetic procedure is something where someone feels very refreshed. Someone looks at that individual and says, my God, you look fantastic, without seeing the telltale signs of plastic surgery. Now, can you have this done in, in like a weekend, or like should you allow a week to just sort of heal so that really nobody knows what you had done? Uh, you do need to have appropriate healing time, but today there are so many minimally invasive procedures that, that we perform that allow us to get patients back to their normal routine, they're back very quickly. All right, I love the fact that it's, it's faster, it's quicker, and it's even better. It is, there's no question, it's natural. Natural, that's the key word. Thank uh, you very much. You're welcome. We're gonna remember that word, natural. <laughs> we'll call 623-516-2639 for a complimentary consultation, or you can go ahead and email Dr. Katowski at info at bodybykatowski.com. You can find Dr. Katowski at the Cosmetic Surgery Institute located at 19636 North 27th Avenue in Phoenix. And you can also give them a call. There's the number on your screen, 623-516-2639. Or check them out online at bodybykatowski.com. The Cosmetic Surgery Institute is a sponsor of Sonoran Living Life. 
It's important to let patients know when too much plastic surgery is being done and enough is enough. We have many patients that come into this practice that have expectations and thought processes about getting plastic surgery when in reality they've already had enough. And it's important for the physician to diagnose a patient appropriately and give them the appropriate direction on what it is that they need to do. You need to trust your physician. It's important that there is a true relationship between the patient and the doctor. And that starts from the time that they come in for their initial evaluation, the time that they come in for surgery, and then their post-operative care. All those things are key to the optimal result. I hope you've enjoyed the weekend edition of Body by Katoski. If you or any of your friends have any questions regarding cosmetic surgery, please feel free to contact me at bodybykatoski.com. Have a great weekend. Thank you.